Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Shweta Vijay and today I'm going to be talking about my product of the month. Now I did not do this last month, uh, but I did the month before and the product of that month was Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance Palette which is my ultimate favorite palette if you guys are still thinking and contemplating whether to buy it or not or to invest in that eyeshadow palette then i suggest you to just go to the info bar and check that video of mine but before i start please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that little bell next to the subscription button so you will be notified every time i put up a new video uh, do subscribe guys it is for free and at the same time do say hi to me on my instagram account facebook Twitter and on Snapchat. I interact with you guys a lot more on social media. So the product of the month goes to The Ordinary and if you guys don't know what The Ordinary is, if you're living under a rock as usual, uh, The Ordinary is a number one skincare brand right now uh, because it's a Canadian vegan skincare brand and it, had, it has taken the entire beauty world by storm only because you're getting quality product for half the price. I started my Ordinary skincare regime last year around September when I first heard about it and I have not changed my skincare ever since. These products, most of the ordinary skincare products is not more than eight pounds. They are catering to the skincare needs of their customers and the beauty of it is they know that how expensive great skincare is in the market out there. You are paying for the brand, you're paying for the packaging, but here the packaging is decent. You're just paying for the ingredients that goes into this and that's about it. Guys, actual ingredients don't cost a lot of things. It is just the branding and it is just, um, you know, the packaging and the way the marketing is done. You are paying for that. The four products that made it to my product of the month list, one is the Hyaluronic Acid, which is 2%. And you guys, if you have followed me for a while and you have seen my previous skincare regime, which I shall leave the link there, just check it out, my top skincare brands. If you are someone who suffers with acne just like mine, if you have problematic skin, then you have to see the products that I was talking about. And over there also, I mentioned about the Hyaluronic Serum. Guys, I've been using this since last year and I cannot emphasize the importance of hyaluronic serum into your skincare regime. A drop of a hyaluronic acid makes your skin uh, feel so hydrated. It is like as if your skin is drinking about 10 glasses of water. That is how potent and that is how special a hyaluronic serum is for your skin. It makes your skin look very plumpy and hydrated skin just, you know, gets rid of those fine lines and it just makes your skin a lot more bright, brighter and more youthful. This is around five pounds 5.99 to around six pounds and you're getting potent hyaluronic serum which you just apply for your daytime wear or for your nighttime and you're good to go the second one that i had to talk about is the vitamin c serum this is the suspension 23 percent they have put it in a tube and vitamin c is so important for your skin this is a regime that you have to like how retinol is it's a regime that you only have to wear at night you cannot wear a vitamin c or a retinol during the daytime because it will i mean you're not supposed to have direct sunlight hit your skin once you apply a very potent vitamin c on your face with the vitamin C, I can't even tell you, I mean, you guys know what the benefits are. It will take away your fine lines. It helps in aging skin. It just plumps up your skin, gives you a youthful skin. It makes your skin a lot more brighter. It takes away acne scars. Uh, you know, it makes sure that, you know, new acne doesn't form on your skin. The benefits of vitamin C is plenty. So if you guys have followed me for a while, you guys know how addicted I am to the high fluidity primer. I have used it in so many of my tutorials. I do not start my makeup routine without using the high fluidity primer. They've got two types of primer, but I suggest you to get the high spreadability fluid primer only because it just something about that primer guys you know it has ingredients that works for your skin because usually a primer just clogs your pores and it just makes your pores you know anything that's got silicon base it's basically to go into your pores and make you know it covers your pores so that makeup you know will sit on top of that and what it does a silicon primer it just makes it it makes your pores bigger and bigger so a silicon primer is actually not a good thing for you but the high fluidity primer they made it in such a way that it has ingredients that work for your skin and there is something about that primer guys the moment you just put it on your skin your makeup just sits beautifully your your makeup i mean your skin looks like skin there is no cakiness it just makes your makeup last all day 
It is one of the best primer I have ever come across. The Ordinary has so many other products that they are quite famous for, especially the coffee serum, the under eye serum made out of coffee, uh, a caffeine or whatever. I have never tried that because for me, I always do my DIY under eye serum. Anything to do with under eye serums or oils, I don't apply anything that is store bought. I make it on my own, but I have to tell you that uh, there is another one that retinol is something that's one of their best sellers so retinol is also like I told you like vitamin C and retinol that is something that you include in your you know skincare regime if you have acne issues when I was battling cystic acne I always thought that applying essential oils on my face would just aggravate my you know <laughs> acne but the thing is there are certain oils that would do that and you really need to understand what your skin actually needs. Organic extra virgin coconut oil is great if you want to put it on your hair, you want to put it under your eyes or on your lips, you know, to just make it much more supple and softer. But even to remove your makeup, I suggest you could use an extra virgin organic coconut oil because it's much more milder. But after you remove your makeup, you have to make sure that you do not have any of that coconut oil on your face. You have to wash your face really well because it has a tendency to clog your pores and that can make you break out even more. This is their rosehip oil. The Trilogy one was around 13, 14 pounds and I got this for around 9 pounds from The Ordinary. This is the 100% organic cold pressed rosehip seed oil and oh my lord, this is incredible. I will have to do an updated skin skincare routine of mine because I finally found certain products that are that is working for my skin and acne is something that I have battled for for a very long time I still continue to you know have skin issues and I'm still working on it so I know what it takes to you know fight acne and I know the kind of products that could work for you and could help you it takes away your acne scars it just makes your skin a little more plump there is it works it's like nature's retinol basically so even if you are someone who finds retinol a bit too harsh for you because retinol does take away your acne scars but it can be extremely drying on your skin but if you want a milder version of a retinol and you want like a natural retinol then I suggest you to go get the rosehip oil because your skin is going to thank you for it and forget about that this is only meant for problematic skin this is meant for aging skin this is meant for especially dry skin dry skin ages faster so this is good for dry skin this is good for combination skin normal skin and especially acne or problematic skin this is going to be your best friend so guys this completes the video and i hope you really enjoyed that i'm going to make this much more regular i'm going to find that one skincare hair care or makeup product that is absolutely outstanding and talk about it besides my monthly favorites that's a whole different video so i shall see you very soon until later bye for now